All right. Welcome back to Lords of the Fallen. I've been jogging around this place trying to figure out what I'm supposed to do next. I see a chest through there, but I ain't figured a way to get in there yet. A little puppy over there, but I, I'll leave him alone. But I've been jogging around, getting my exercise while I'm stuck. I come up here, clean out some bad fellers. And I'd always come over here and like see him dancing boy sitting over there. So I'll take him out. And I just keep repeating the process. I can't figure out what I'm missing. I even jump up and down on these grates and see if it's supposed to be down there. But then you see right in front of me there's a hole I keep missing. I guess that statue keep, gets my attention and then I look at the other baddie and never notice this. Why well, ain't that crazy? It's just like it just appeared. It's like finding an extra room in your house you never knew you had. That's crazy, man. That's crazy. Well, I'll come over here and clean out these fellers. If there's a save spot here. And our little cave there is poor core. There ain't much in there worth the effort of jumping across, but I did it off screen. But I'll go and find the kind of the main area that you're supposed to be. fighting in. There's another feller that was here that had a heart that you had to get out of a jar in order to get him. So here we go. Well, he spotted me right off. I will sit and stab after him. He's been working on his uppercut. These chests, I've not been figured, I ain't figured out how to open them either. They got a red seal on them, so I figured it was the big room versus the small room. Every once in a while, you'll see a chest with a white seal on it and a small rune will open that up but a big rune won't do it won't do the job on this one so I don't know we'll keep on going uh, I rely too much on magic I gotta swing this weapon a bit gotta see what's going on here But, yeah, there was another feller here too, but I took him out while well, I was all frustrated on trying to figure it out. At least we got us another safe spot. Well, the guy tricked you. I, I won't hold it against him. Those stairs are hard on the old knees. We'll see if this does a job. Yeah, if I don't run through the fire, 
But that's what I've been doing all my life, running through the fire. It creates a hardened tool. Yeah, the old small runes will open up some doors and some chests if they're kind of got a white seal on it. That red one's got me stumped right now. Well, that looks like maybe the place we are to go. Well, ain't that a beauty? Oh, Lord. That didn't work as planned. I might have to figure this out. Huh. Well. And Stab just uppercutted right through him and didn't do a thing. And he takes these huge leaps. And I'm gone. Hmm. Let me think about this a bit. All right, I switched over to a cleric build with a little different magic set. I've been working on him kind of off camera just because I like to play sometimes and not record. So I was going to see if that's going to help matters any at all. He's got ram instead of this stab that's kind of beneficial you see he kind of caught me in a corner so I sped her up I had to take out a couple of seconds there where I uh, used some colorful metaphors I was kind of ashamed of I had to wash my mouth out with soap but I was still having trouble figuring him out Because he kept doing that and he was just jumping on me. Worse than coming home and having a, your dog jump on you. Well, I guess if you're a dog person, you don't mind. But if it, that dog looks like that, you definitely mind. But then I, done, I started getting as close as I could. So, well, far away ain't working. Let me just get real close. And that started, that started doing a little better. I could actually walk under his legs while he tried to hit me. And then if I got an opening, I would ram him. Well, that was an accident there, but... If you're close and you stand still, it don't work. But if you're close and, you, and you're moving right or left, you'll move under his legs. But... He sets those traps there and they grab you. Kind of messed your thing up a little. And then that stinger, 
if you're moving well enough. I figured it out a little bit better with Stab's character. I'll get them both running and then whichever one does the best. There we go. I'd say that was all in a hard day's work. I got my experience back from the numerous times I died. Well, probably from the last one, but it took a while. So hopefully we can get out of here. Well, maybe. I kind of figured he'd drop something, but... Oh, and that's nice with this character, too. When you pray, he actually gives you health. So you don't have to waste a potion since I'm down to two anyway, just from the battle. The other ones, like on stabs, I think it's maybe endurance. And I got another rogue I'm playing with that is magic. But the rogue, yeah, it, it sucks. If you want something like extremely hard difficulty, yeah, choose the rogue. Well, looks like girlfriend's down here. I guess that was my spoils of war. Wow. I have to admit that was impressive. Lots of training. Sure. And taking care of that guy for you was just easy peasy. I would have managed. Well, to the victor goes the spoils. So I'll take this as a souvenir. What are you going to do with all those stone tablets? You have way too many. Let me help you out. Here you go. Pleasure doing business with you. So long, and watch out for snakes. Hmm. Watch out for snakes. I'm not for sure where she's been exploring, but I hadn't seen any snakes. She really must be doing a lot. She looks like a thief anyway, we have here. Crook not kill Rohak. Give me a good reason why I shouldn't kill you right now. Hilka reward me, you, Craig. A reward for what? Go on. Craig Ruhar brings skull. Craig human skull. Rohak reward. What need of you for human skulls? Make potion crack. Pain Uric stop. Cry. Give crack shield. Rock room spell on shield. Crack real. Fifteen skull rura. Okay, I switched over to Stab's character. This nut job's wanting some skulls, and he has plenty of them. So I got that infiltrator 
with this character. Claw bring skull. I have some right. And he here. gives me this. Ulish many skull. Shield. Claw, claw. It says more, but I had plenty. Once fifteen, I had like twenty one, twenty two. Stand shield. So I'll go up here. That spring, screen will split in a minute because that another feller at the top of the stairs took me out. But I'm just getting wore out. I'm going to speed this up a bit though. Quick, take him out of here. Gah! What are you doing here? We saw this shining door while running from the Rogar, so we jumped in. Could there be anything worse? We can't get back now. And the captain? He'll never forgive us. We're trapped. You escaped the Rogar and came here. And how on earth could we know where it would take us? What happened to him? This place is swarming with monsters. They got him bad. If he doesn't get any medicine, he's done for. Please, you must have a spare potion. There. That should do the job for now. You better leave. Well, we were on our way to the tower by the bridge, the one on the right. We thought we'd hide there, but there's a powerful demon guarding it. If you want to stay alive, you should get back to Keystone. And face the guard, Captain. Forget about it. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Well, I guess I reckon I can clean that place out for him. Oh well, I tell you what, I'm gonna clean this out for him in double speed because I feel a nap coming on. So, there you go, bub.
You returned. Did you clear the way? Yes. We won't forget this. Here. Yeah. It's not much, but it may come in handy. Well, I cleared the way for those fellers. Now, take time to get out of here. I think I'll go through the portal and call it a video. Well, I'll let you go, and I'll see you on the other side. Bye.